I, I don't know what to say. I, just, I'm, I'm, too, I'm so thrilled to just be stealing DVDs from your closet that I'm, I'm shaking. Never seen Written on the Wind, which is, which is shameful. I'm excited to add this to my collection. It's the original Criterion logo. I like, I like having the old little line, little text, this is Criterion. This is probably my favorite documentary, and this is the movie I've seen probably the most times of any movie. I've probably seen this over 100 times. The shooting, this is, this, I love this movie. Uh, Monty Hellman, I stayed with him in his beautiful bed and breakfast. The Horse's Mouth, this is my dad's favorite movie. I guess I'm gonna have to take Pickpocket because I bought this when it came out and I watched it so many times that it's all scratched up now and there's a great thing of Paul Schrader talking about the movie. I'm almost nervous to be here because I'm afraid these are all gonna collapse on me. I feel like I'm surrounded by what I love. I have this already, but this is my, one of my favorite things that ever came out. Criterion. This beautiful box of Robert Downey Sr. movies. I went to a screening of Chafed Elbows years ago at Anthology, and uh, I found this thing on eBay. It's this photograph of him directing um, Up the Academy, the Mad Magazine movie, and he's in a uh, cowboy hat, and he's like pretending to direct Alfred E. Newman, this like, little midget man in a mask. And I showed it to Downey Sr., and he looked at it and goes, Sorry about that one. And I said, oh, I actually really like Up the Academy. And he was like, he just looked at me with disgust. So I think I disappointed him. I'm trying to think, oh, this is something I've always been curious about. The Golden Age of Television, because it has the original version of Marty. Timothy Carey uh, made a movie, who's, he's one of the guys that's killed in the end of the movie, and all uh, he was the only actor that uh, that Kubrick allowed to improvise, and uh, he made a crazy movie that I love that I don't think has ever been on DVD called The World's Greatest Sinner that everyone should try to see. Great opening scene. Great last shot, too. Great little moment where uh, Shot Corridor is on a marquee. Goodbye.